Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. I'm Rupert. I'm Charlie. Today we're actually, despite the rainy day, we're here in Camden. Uh, we're going to go around some shops, maybe try out some street food. Lots to see here. Yeah. Um, so yeah, we're going to take you on this journey. Can't wait to show you around what's going on. Right, let's roll. So obviously here in Camden, we're in the Stable Street part. Hey, this place is so, so many cool, shops man, here. So Hang on, wait, we got some uh, water on the lens. Yeah, so there's like just so much to see, so much to do. Like Camden, to be honest, is like filled with shops. You can um, get so many good things for a decent price. I love this place, it's so much fun. Good Halloween costumes, seeing it's now Halloween coming up. Any books you like to read, Josh? Oh, I can't read. You can't read? I can't read. Neither can I. Gotta keep it down in here. Shut the fuck up. Oh. Oh, these are my many leather bound books. Um, Josh, I didn't know you did male nudity. <laughs> Super yacht owner's guide. Because uh, that's what you really need right now is a super yacht owner's guide. Takes me back to those yachting days. In case you didn't know before, so me and Rupert we used to work on board super yachts as part of like what the last three years? Four years! <laughs> I was uh, chefing and Rupert was scrubbing teak. <laughs> so no, we were just like we used to work aboard on board yachts uh, for the last three years. It's kind of where we sort of travelled the world. And and we worked on the same yacht and shared a cabin, and that was hilarious. <laughs> yeah, that was good fun. Good, good lot of uh, memories. Search cool hats. Should, get, should we get our own DOS mouse hats? Yeah. <laughs> fucking flesh now. Get the comic book store. Any belt you could possibly want in the whole entire world, they probably sell it here. We used to play this game religiously. <laughs> you guys know I carry love Sunday. You can carry this vlog on that one. They've got a Luke Skywalker going for a hundred quid, man, that's insane. So obviously lost to see down here, let's go check out some more. This one, this one is called Condio. So it's a, a cheese from nor north of Italy, and it's cow's milk and it's stuffed with herbs. So it smells really, really good. Amazing. Um, yeah, I love this. Mm. Sorry, I'm back. I literally just had to try and find Josh <laughs> for like Hi guys. 10, 15 minutes. Your app is wrong. To be fair, I was there like for good, probably like 10 seconds. <laughs> I saw this pin for like 10 minutes. I was like, you know what? I know Josh Burnham well enough to know that he won't stay in that pin for more than 10 seconds. I, yeah, I get distracted pretty easy. The same for if I got really attracted by Josh and Rupert. Yeah, no. So there is lots and lots to do and see here. And um, you know, you can pick every, anything up for a really, really good price. So I'd really, really highly, highly, highly recommend it. It's a really great vibe, man. Like, you know, in terms of what London offers um, and just being somewhere really, really generally cool, uh, this place has definitely, definitely got it. You want to know what I love about Camden so much is that it kind of reminds me of Brighton and no one really gives a fuck, like, no matter what you wear, no matter what you're doing, everyone's pretty chilled, like, it's a good attitude, <coughs> a good attitude. Like, wear, like, do whatever you want and like, Camden, yeah, it definitely has that vibe that like Brighton has in the lanes, uh, like all the, like, the trinket shops and clothes shops, I think it's epic. Charlie, yo, let's get into this. Let's go over here. Yeah, what was that thing you tried that last time with the cornbread? That was the Venezuelan. I'm, I'm gonna, gonna try that, that one. Yeah. It's Ordering 
doing, Charlie? So this is like a Venezuelan. Which one is it? Street food. So it's the pavlon, so it's got shredded beef, melted cheese, black beans, avocado, pick of the guys. So good. I had it last time, I had to get it again because it was just so delicious. So I just checked out um, a Venezuelan street kitchen, it's absolutely delicious. Like With the cornbread they just like crisp up on the pancha, which is delicious. Um, so you get a crunch factor in there with the, the pulled beef, which is just melting in your mouth. And uh, with a bit of cheese and some avocado, it's a pick of the guy to like liven it up. And then you just kind of got some plantain in there, which they fry up. So it just kind of sweetens everything up in the bite. So you kind of layer up the whole thing. It's just absolutely delicious. So um, it's nice to see Venezuelan food because you don't see it much often in Camden, so or anywhere for that factor. So um, I really highly recommend you come check it out if you come to Camden to see that street food store there. Street food. It's an alcove bit. It took me two seconds to eat that. <laughs> Chin -chin. I know it's a rainy day, but we're actually going to get some ice cream because it's a Saturday and why not have ice cream on a Saturday? There's no such thing as a day not having ice cream, whether it's raining, whether it's shining sun, you can just have it any time. So shout out to Chin Chin. Um, I've heard so many good things about this place, so let's crack it on. This is one of their best sellers. This is the caramel uh, sandwich, cookie sandwich. As you can obviously see. Oh, that's insane. It is insane. Do you want to hold it? Do you want to help? This doesn't really taste like it. It tastes like it. It's because it's real vanilla. That's real vanilla. So vanilla, what we eat now, is not how we think it is. Basically, the reason why vanilla is so expensive is because it's really hard to get. So what's the difference between real vanilla and this vanilla pot? It's the actual pot. So like, you'll, you'll see it in like, the next like, 10 years, everyone will have like, a little vanilla pot. They'll be like, what the fuck is that? And like, oh, it's vanilla. They'll be like, no way. Because it's actually, it's actually getting extinct. All of that ice cream is a lot to eat. Absolutely delicious though. The vegan was the best The vegan one was very good. I really enjoyed the pumpkin. Good choice. You thought the sandwich, I thought the vanilla. Ooh, we all have different conflicting yeah. choices. We basically enjoyed the one that we have. Yeah. <laughs> we all enjoyed the one that we have. Yeah. <laughs> okay guys, so that includes our rainy day here in Camden. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Again, a shout out to what was it, Chin Chin uh, ice cream, absolutely phenomenal. It's like liquid nitrogen. I would honestly say just going there alone uh, was the, like, the best reason of coming here. So uh, good. Same to all the other traders and all the other food stores that we've been to today. Thank you so much. It was absolutely delicious. So, yeah, man. Thank you guys so much for watching this week's episode. Give us a shout out in the comments where you want us to go next. Um, like and subscribe to our channel and hopefully we can push as many of these videos as much as possible. But thank you again for watching and we'll see you guys in the next episode. In the next episode.